We're at the Nissan Pavilion outside of Washington, D.C. The crews are loading in all the gear from these trucks for tonight's show. And we'll be talking with Rick Allen, the legendary drummer from the band Def Leppard. And he's got something for our wounded warriors, so let's go. I'm here backstage at the Def Leppard concert with Rick Allen, the drummer, and Lauren Monroe, his wife. Being a part of a band like Def Leppard that's had so many hits and been around for so long, especially in a musical climate where lots of groups don't last that long, how, how is it for you and how have you guys been able to do that? I think with Def Leppard, the most important thing is uh, the friendship. The friendship that we have and um, also the fact that we, we've written great songs. and. Um, you know, playing these songs in rehearsals is one thing, but once we get them in front of an audience, they take on a, an incredible life of their own. You guys, Def Leppard, have an opportunity for military members uh, and veterans to get free tickets to your concerts? Uh, we saw a need uh, to, um, I don't know, just, um, just give people a night out, a really good night out, a bonding experience with their families. Well, you just go to ravendrumfoundation.org and the information's there to get the tickets for every show on the tour. Can you kind of tell uh, some of our viewers a little bit more about what that's about? The Raven Drum Foundation is, is really, what well, really came about through, uh, through my own experience, or the inspiration was from my, my own experience, my, my car accident. But it really came about when myself and Lauren uh, got together. My background's in massage therapy and uh, integrative therapies. I met Rick as a, a patient, he was a patient that came to me, and we saw how the drums, paid, you know, like everyone knows, played such an incredible role in his healing. And then we brought about other aspects of healing, including massage therapy and breathing techniques and meditation, and all these really helped him recover um, or begin to travel a path of healing, um, working out of post-traumatic stress. And so that's what the foundation is built upon, you know, the center is the drum, and also we incorporate uh, other modalities to help people empower themselves and to really find a path of healing. And it's not just with veterans, it's also with their wives, their spouses, and their families. For you personally, I mean, I know it was probably quite a journey going through just, you know, bad days when you're frustrated, uh, didn't maybe think that you could recover and, and keep drumming. And I'm sure you had other days where you were feeling on top of the world. I think the most important thing for me is to call somebody and, and either either be of service, which helps me tremendously. It takes me out of uh, my own uh, self-pity. Um, and that, that, I think that works at whatever stage you're at. Out of the people that we have uh, either in theater or might have just come back, did you guys have any special words that you wanted to pass on to them? Just love and respect, you know? Um, and just really, uh, yeah, just follow your hearts. We're thinking about you. To view this podcast and more, log on to pentagonchannel.mil.